Our world is an incredible mix of impossible to explain phenomenon and overwhelming information that's left many puzzled as to the nature of strange things from around the world. To bring these mysterious phenomena to light and provide them with an understandable explanation, scientists and researchers have conducted a variety of tests. Although they've done a great job at helping us understand certain discoveries and anomalies, there's some that still remain a mystery. One place that's of particular interest is that of Antarctica, with the frozen wasteland hiding many artifacts that are just waiting to be discovered. The most recent discovery to come from Antarctica was found by someone using Google Earth. A number of different photographs were posted to social media showing something sticking out of the ground in Antarctica, with those who saw the images saying that it looked like a giant pyramid was peeking out of the snow, and this caused some to say that this artifact could be visible due to the melting ice. One of the users who stated they found the image first said they were looking through Antarctica, and could see something that appeared to be higher than the surrounding area. They said that they then clicked on the 3D version of Google Earth, and could see the structure much more easily, saying that the first thing that came to mind when they saw it was that of a pyramid. Others who saw the images said the structure does look like an ancient pyramid, and even compared the overall look to that of the Mesoamerican pyramids. Those who believe that these are pyramids give different ideas for who is behind them. There's some that believe that ancient man travelled to Antarctica thousands of years ago, and started building large structures, the same as what can be seen in other ancient civilizations. While there's another group of people that believe that Antarctica may have been inhabited by an advanced civilization, noting that books and ancient writings talk about humanoids much more advanced than modern man, and they've said that this civilization could have lived in Antarctica. One user said the following about the image. This is just the most recent photograph to emerge. There's many that are like this and that seem to depict large structures. I understand that scientists have a certain way of thinking and like to push their views, but you'd think that curiosity would get the better of them and that they'd want to investigate what these things are. To me it seems interesting that we have large structures sticking out of Antarctica, yet most academics don't seem interested in them. Well this user said the following, Time and time again we've been wrong about Antarctica, and each time the science has changed. For example, years back scientists said that Antarctica was not of interest, and that there's nothing there. But now we know that it holds complex life forms in underground lakes. Early asteroids have been found there. A huge anomaly is located under Wilkesland. An ancient jungle once existed here, and also the land was once inhabited by dinosaurs, and this was backed up by the recent dinosaur fossils that were discovered. End quote. It's for this reason that some have said that scientists and researchers should be more open-minded about these kinds of discoveries, saying that humans could have spread to the continent of Antarctica and started building here. Skeptics, though, are not won over by these types of photographs, and have said they can be easily explained when you look at the surroundings of these images, saying that when UFOs are allegedly found in Antarctica, look around the area and you will normally find mountains nearby and what's likely happened is a piece of ice has fallen off this mountain, and has left a mark in the snow, and this is what people are claiming is a UFO. They also apply the same to these structures, saying that they're not pyramids, but rather rocks that have become visible due to the melting ice. They say that we've never found anything of interest, and that all of these photographs can be easily explained. Believers, though, have said this isn't the case, and that many of these strange objects can be found scattered throughout Antarctica. One believer said the following about the skeptics. It's interesting that skeptics have the same mindset as hardcore theorists. A hardcore theorist believes in everything, and skeptics believe in nothing. They're pretty much the mirror version of each other. I think it's healthy to keep an open mind about these kinds of discoveries, but I think we should also look at other possibilities. 
It could be a pyramid, or it could just be an area that's been revealed by the melting ice. This photograph is one of the most interesting ones that I've seen, and I think it could show a large pyramid. End quote. To show how unpredictable the area is, scientists were surprised when they found hot flows of volcanic magma underneath Antarctica. Nestled on a remote bit of land in the South Sandwich Islands, researchers confirmed suspicions of a lava lake by taking high quality imagery, and this was of a known active volcano in the area. Scientists believe that the massive lava lake has a diameter somewhere between 90 and 250 meters, with a pool of lava reaching heats of 1000 degrees Celsius. Lava lakes are giant pools of molten lava built up in craters, volcanic vents or other geological spaces. And while we might imagine volcanoes being the perfect place for a big pool of lava, long-lasting lava lakes are not a common occurrence, and to find one in such an isolated part of the world is an incredible feat. So what do you make of these mysterious photographs? Do you think they show ancient pyramids, or is it just a case of pareidolia? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comment section below, and help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.